A fit, well-fed adult can sustain 75 watts power output over an eight hour working day. In that same time, the sun is giving us three or four times as much energy on each square meter. That's three or four people standing on each square meter ready to help me do whatever I want. If only we realized how much energy we actually have. With this little mirror here, we can easily cook for 30 people several times a day. Cooking with light, it's an incredibly simple technology. A few square meters of shiny stuff and some basic mathematics. In a way, you could have done this a thousand years ago. But a little bit of high tech helps. Let's go to the lab. Welcome to the workshop. So this mirror has a thousandth of a millimeter thick aluminium deposited on a tenth of a millimeter thick polymer film. The physicist Dr. Hans Kleinwächter developed these mirrors using this material over 30 years ago. They hold the focus of the sun on a fixed point on Earth as the Earth rotates beneath them. The concentrated solar energy can be stored as heat in sand at up to 500 or even 1000 degrees C. This heat is then available for cooking, cooling, heating, for electrical and mechanical power generation, even high energy, high temperature needs such as metalwork 24 hours a day. Sand is a surprisingly good heat store, together with low temperature Stirling engines, also developed by Jürgen Kleinwächter. These mirrors and sand storage can form the heart of a new energy system that no longer depends on exploitation of our planet Earth or its people.